Hey folks, it's Iratron, you know what time it is. It's Nintendo time. So, for this evening, we are firing up the Super Nintendo emulator on the PlayStation 3. Tonight, we are playing one fine game for the, uh, the old SNES called Zombies 8, My Neighborhood. My brother and I used to play this game back in the day, a long time ago when he was just a boy. Anyways, uh, it's a classic. I, you know, I don't ever remember beating it, beating it, but um, now it just seems like the right time to do it with you guys watching. Thanks for joining us, by the way. Make sure you like, subscribe, rate, uh, all that stuff. And, uh, yeah, let us know. If you like, great. If you don't, let us know that as well, okay? I'm sure you guys can be really active. Uh, Anyways, man, look at the level design in this game. There's this toxic crap and <laughs> tombstones in a cemetery and all that good stuff. And the the mission is to race around the neighborhood, uh, saving your neighbors from the uh, the zombags. And I have to tell you guys something: the graphics are right on par with The Walking Dead uh, survival instincts. Which, by the way, I do intend on beating one of these days. I just can't bring myself to play it right now. I don't want to get too depressed, you know? Anyways. Yeah, the sound effects are right on with The Walking Dead. Duh. Gameplay. Yeah, it's just spot on, pretty much. Except for this one's fun. You know, he's got to hop in the pool. Uh, there's something I'm missing here. Uh, a couple more keys or something like that we can select. I, I think there's a, uh, a, I guess, a safari guy someplace. We'll find them, and what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll knock out two levels at a time uh, with this game because it's freaking awesome. Ah, there we go, cool beans, cool beans. And bam, and that's how it's done, son. Not a speed run by any means, but it's all right. All right, all re rectums, uh, victims saved. Yeah. Level two. Level dose. Evening of the undead. Sounds like a plan. Oh. Hello, Commando. You know, I don't remember exactly how to switch weapons in this. Guess I better figure that out figure that out pretty quick. Take care of that dude. Oh hey, there's a map. Remember this folks, R1 is your map. Uh, what on earth? Oh, so I healed myself, I guess. Oh, okay. So X. X will change your weapons. Sounds like a plan. Let's go save some innocents. Innocent folks. Ah, and you know what? This is... What's beautiful about this game is that you can play it two-player! Ah, my buddy Chris. Ah, we should could definitely get together and play this one. <laughs> I'm sure that uh, the beef won't draw in the dead. <laughs> Here we go, collect some gold for some reason. Yeah, it seems like you can go through the vines. There you go, collect some more ammo. Lone survivor in here someplace. A child, perhaps. And then I think uh, some safari dude. Bam! Bam! Oh! Dang it! 
Gotta pick up some coins, man. Yeah, come on. Let me know I'm wasting my time collecting the money. I guess I could have got that child. I'll come back for him. We'll just let him be. Let's see what happens. I wonder how many folks can die before this game, I don't know, ends. Before it says game over. Something about this also reminds me of uh, Maniac Mansion for some reason. Gosh, I'm gonna play that game. Let us know in the comments section uh, of this video what games you would like to see. Please. If there's something you want to see, like Speedrun of Mario. Uh, Mario Arcade. Whatever. Definitely let us know. Anyways, folks, as promised, two levels. That's how it's done, son. Definitely stay tuned. Um, post in the comment section if you'd like to see more. And we'll talk to you soon. Hoorah! La, 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 la. Everybody's going to